In string theory and related theories such as supergravity theories, a brin is a physical object that generalizes the notion of a point particle to higher dimensions. Brins are dynamical objects which can propagate through spacetime according to the rules of quantum mechanics. They have mass and can have other attributes such as charge. Mathematically, brins can be represented within categories, and are studied in pure mathematics for insight into homological mirror symmetry and noncommutative geometry. P brins A point particle can be viewed as a brin of dimension 0, while a string can be viewed as a brin of dimension 1. In addition to point particles and strings, it is possible to consider higher dimensional brins. A p-dimensional brin is generally called p-brin. The term p-brin was coined by M. J. Duff et al. in 1988. Brin comes from the word membrane, which refers to a two-dimensional brin. A p-brin sweeps out a p plus one dimensional volume in spacetime called its world volume. Physicists often study fields analogous to the electromagnetic field, which live on the world volume of a brin. D brins In string theory, a string may be open forming a segment with two endpoints or closed forming a closed loop. D brins are an important class of brins that arise when one considers open strings. As an open string propagates through spacetime, its endpoints are required to lie on a D brin. The letter D in D brin refers to Dirichlet boundary condition, which the D brin satisfies. One crucial point about D brins is that the dynamics on the D brin world volume is described by a gauge theory, a kind of highly symmetric physical theory which is also used to describe the behavior of elementary particles in the standard model of particle physics. This connection has led to important insights into gauge theory and quantum field theory. For example, it led to the discovery of the ADS CFT correspondence, a theoretical tool that physicists use to translate difficult problems in gauge theory into more mathematically tractable problems in string theory. Topic: <laughs> Categorical description. Mathematically, brins can be described using the notion of a category. This is a mathematical structure consisting of objects, and for any pair of objects, a set of morphisms between them. In most examples, the objects are mathematical structures such as sets, vector spaces, or topological spaces and the morphisms are functions between these structures. One can also consider categories where the objects are d-brins and the morphisms between two brins. Alpha display style alpha and beta display style beta are states of open strings stretched between alpha display style alpha and beta display style beta in one version of string theory known as the topological B model, the D brins are complex submanifolds of certain six dimensional shapes called Calabi Yau manifolds, together with additional data that arise physically from having charges at the endpoints of strings. Intuitively, one can think of a submanifold as a surface embedded inside of a Calabi Yau manifold, although submanifolds can also exist in dimensions different from two. In mathematical language, the category having these brins as its objects is known as the derived category of coherent sheaves on the Calabi Yau. In another version of string theory called the topological A model, the D brins can again be viewed as submanifolds of a Calabi Yau manifold. Roughly speaking, they are what mathematicians call special Lagrangian submanifolds. This means, among other things, that they have half the dimension of the space in which they sit, and they are length, area, or volume minimizing. The category having these brins as its objects is called the Fukaya category. The derived category of coherent sheaves is constructed using tools from complex geometry, a branch of mathematics that describes geometric curves in algebraic terms and solves geometric problems using algebraic equations. On the other hand, the Fukaya category is constructed using symplectic geometry, a branch of mathematics that arose from studies of classical physics. 
Symplectic geometry studies spaces equipped with a symplectic form, a mathematical tool that can be used to compute area in two dimensional examples. The homological mirror symmetry conjecture of Maxim Kontsevich states that the derived category of coherent sheaves on one Calabi Yau manifold is equivalent in a certain sense to the Fukaya category of a completely different Calabi Yau manifold. This equivalence provides an unexpected bridge between two branches of geometry, namely complex and symplectic geometry. See also Black Brin Brin cosmology Dirac membrane M2 Brin M5 Brin NS5 Brin Notes